Give me an E. Give me an O. It's one of the hottest stocks in retail, and the CEO joins me tonight. Yeah, exclusive. I mean, like, really super duper exclusive. And that's the CEO of American Eagle Outfitters. Stay with Kramer. Last night, American Eagle Outfitters pre-announced some incredibly strong results for the first quarter, which still has two weeks left. It's ahead of their appearance at the J.P. Morgan Retail Roundup Conference today, and that's the big conference for retail. We've been following this teen apparel chain ever since last summer when my favorite retail analyst, Matthew Boss, over at J.P. Morgan, started pushing it as part of his lag trade. That's L Brands, American Eagle Outfitters, and Gap. That's why I started recommending American Eagle Outfitters six months ago at 15 smackers. Since then, it surged to 34 bucks. And honestly, at the numbers we saw last night, I, it isn't done. I think he's got more. Management says first quarter revenue should exceed $1 billion. That's up substantially versus the first quarter of 2019. Yes, and that is the closest pre-COVID comparison. Even better, operating income has more than doubled over the same period. No wonder the stock jumped 4% today. I think we should take a closer look with Jay Schottenstein. He's the executive chairman and CEO of American Eagle Outfit. It's so exciting to hear more about this pre-announcement and his company's prospects. Mr. Schottenstein, congratulations on the res- results. Welcome to Mad Money. And how did you do it? Well, Jim, I thank you for that. Uh, we did it uh, for, for the past. Uh, we've been doing it for the past like year. Uh, our people have been very focused. Our stores have been a very welcoming place. Uh, when you go in our store, you feel safe to shop. Uh, many of the consumers love shopping in our store. They feel safe. Our, our merchandise is right. Uh, we've been on uh, Target. Uh, you look at Aerie, which is the hottest, uh, hottest, hottest store in the country right now. We, have, we only have 26 consecutive quarters of double-digit comps. And we're about to have our 27th uh, quarter, which may be closer to triple digit comps. And meanwhile, American Eagle is the uh, number one brand for 15 to 25 year olds for denim, number one for ladies for denim, and number three for men for denim. So we've been doing it for a period, for, for like a long period of time. Well, let me ask you a lot of people say the mall is dead. These numbers are better than almost every direct to consumer. Uh, catalog, stay-at-home, web. How are you able to buck that trend? Or are all the rumors of the demise of the mall completely false? No, the mall's not dead. The, the mall's still alive. It's just, it's just right now, people people are still going and shopping, but, but people have to be careful. Uh, in, in our stores, like I said said a second ago, we practice uh, uh, you know proper, proper protocol. We have, we're operating, it's amazing, the sales we're doing, like, like this quarter, uh, you know, all the stores are copying and we're doing it at a 50 percent capacity. So, uh, you know, we're very excited about, you know, about the future of the mall. And, and we think that when uh, when things get better and the pandemic goes away, we're still in the pandemic. But when it goes away, uh, you know, we could be looking at the roaring 20s. Oh, my. You're, you, you and I are totally in sync. That's exactly what I said to Ed Bastian from Delta today. This is the Roaring Twenties. Now, one thing I think people don't understand is the denim cycle. We had Levi's on recently. The denim cycle is the most powerful I have ever seen, Jay. Well, we're, we're, we're so excited about the denim cycle because we are, we've been pushing denim for, since, since 1992. Uh, and, uh, and, and and like I said a second ago, we, we're, we're the number one brand for the 15 to 25 year olds. We're the number one for ladies denim. And with all the silhouette changes going, we think we'll get the we think we'll get the biggest benefit of it. So we're very excited about it. All right, let's talk about the brand that my kids love. Okay, and my kids are in their 20s. This is not they're not teenagers. Uh, Airy, uh, jammies. Well, that's what. That's what my daughter calls them. Uh, leisure wear, stuff that they can hang out in, but also go out. I mean, this brand, which is probably unknown to many of our viewers, you've got to give us a little explanation of how this is right now, I think, the most powerful brand in all of apparel. Well, if you look at our name, Airy, we go Airy Real. We were, we were one of the architects of the body positivity movement. We were the first retailer to not to not 
touch up the models. We have a, uh, a team that's led by, Je by Jen Foyle who are so dedicated to this brand, they are the brand. I mean, they live it, they breathe it, they think it, and, 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 it's, and it's real. I, I mean, we, uh, we encourage people to feel good about themselves, to, to be optimistic, and, and to have self-love. And, uh, and the team is really focused. I mean, um, they're, you know, part, part of Aerie, uh, we have a new line called Offline, where we're opening up the stores. It's Offline by Aerie, which is gonna be in the athleisure area. And we have certain leggings right now, we can't keep in stock. As soon as they come in, they go right out. As a matter of fact, uh, it was amazing that these, these, these uh, leggings took off so fast that we get 40, 50,000 a week. They ship them Monday from uh, overseas. Uh, they arrive Thursday in a distribution center. By Saturday, they'd be in the customer's home and never even hit the store. Wow. Well, look, Jay, I got to congratulate. I mean, this is stunning. And I love why. I think the idea of no pressure, I think the idea of what, which my kids like, my kids just li like it. They just feel like it fits and makes them feel great. And that is something that you've done that few others have accomplished. Jay Schottenstein, Chairman CEO of American Eagle. Congratulations on just an amazing couple of years, not just a quarter. Thank you. Mad Money's back after the break.